Around the world, the, the hats, they are known like Panama hats, but actually they are made in Ecuador. Did you know that Theodore Roosevelt was pictured wearing one of these iconic hats during the construction of the Panama Canal? In fact, it's one of the reasons why it became so popular worldwide. And a trip to Ecuador just isn't complete without leaning in and learning about these historical pieces of wearable art. You can get a Panama hat in $25 or more than $2,000, it depends on the quality. The Panama hat has become a coveted item worldwide, donning the heads of celebrities, politicians, and royalty. However, this now famous fashion accessory comes from humble beginnings. It's quite appreciated by people around the world, not only here, and also it helps to the economy of the different provinces, in this case, this town. We are in the town called Siksik. For hundreds of years, the indigenous people of Ecuador have been weaving hats, and it's an amazing art to watch. Their hands just know which of the hundreds of straws to grasp and twist, and the hats seem to grow magically almost without thought. There are 190 women that they work or they are part of this association. In 2012, UNESCO declared the Panama hat an intangible cultural heritage. And the pride that the Ecuadorian people take in this tradition comes to life when you have the opportunity to meet the artisans. And one of the best ways to do this is with a local guide on an enchanted expeditions tour. Our guides love their country, love what they're doing, and we do too. So that's the whole point of imparting this to our guests. So when you leave, you, you feel you're a friend of this country, you know, and of our people. Panama hats are a true Ecuadorian icon, and meeting the artisans who create them is as magical as the country itself. To discover how you can have a rich cultural experience in Ecuador, go to the new Enchanted Expeditions website and start dreaming about your next adventure.